What's your name, B.O.B.? So they calling you Bob? <laughs> Stop playing, nigga. You know that I'm known for a Bob. <laughs> Hey Snacks, welcome back to my channel. If it's your first time here, welcome to my channel. I am Sneaky Way, the mother of the snacks. Subscribe right now and become a snack. And also, if it's your first time here, I swear I make other videos. So don't just watch the hair video and think, ah, what bora. Please check out my channel. See all the other content that is here. Okay, thank you. Today's video is sponsored by Ellie Pearl, which I've worked with them before and I love their hair. And we're back again with the U part, V part unit from them. And yeah, the, the only difference with this one versus my last one is the fact that this is a bob. Uh, but the standard of the hair, the, the, the quality of the craftsmanship of the wig has remained the same on both wigs that I've tried. Well, on both U slash V part wigs that I've tried from them. I am impressed as I always am. If you guys are interested in seeing how I brought myself together to be the baddie that I am right now. Also, I'm wearing my dress from my collection. Period. Shots mean from a bind breaker. I'm so distracted. Please keep watching to see the hair look come together. <laughs> so dirty no it's the comb <sighs> i think this is jar from my other wig installations i'm gonna fix that later but guys just know my hair's not dirty it's just well it is dirty because now it's been dirty by all this gel with a u part or a v part wig i think all the work happens with the pattern that you take out because i remember the first time i tried to install one of these I left too much leave out out. <laughs> you make me wanna throw my page out the window. Tell MC I to cut the old post. Break my lease so I can move. But you a bugaboo, a bugaboo. I wanna put your number on the call block. F A O L make my email stop. Okay. So here is the pattern. Leave out on the side. Leave out on the side and leave out for the parting. There are five clips in total, three at the top here, two on the sides and one at the bottom, including the elasticated bottom to adjust to your head size. Um, so yeah, the straps are for your head, like the size of the wig. And then the comb at the bottom is to secure that in place so it doesn't like flop up and down and then the combs everywhere else are just to secure the wig in place as well so it's quite simple really you just wear it while you unclip <laughs> the clips you open them and you just wear the wig and secure it so i like putting mine in from the bottom and i secure the clip there and then it just makes it easier to move along the rest of the wig I've just hooked the top. I haven't clipped it down yet because sometimes that adjusts as I secure the other spots. It's feeling like Bob season. I feel like the person that started that thread on Twitter where, um, She's ready where they asked to see us in our bobs. I feel like that ignited a new love for the bob in the wig wearers community rather. Um, so it's feeling very much like bob season, baby. What's your name? B.O.B. So they're calling you Bob. Stop playing, nigga. You know that I'm known for the bob. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Last time I did a U pause, I didn't do edges, and I mean it was cute for that time and that moment. I didn't give basically leave out the corpse because whoa, well, I had to cut my hair, guys, because the braids that I did earlier this year. <sighs> We're not having a big enough conversation about the gel that they use to braid our hair. We're just not. I'm gonna be using the Design Essentials Sleek Max Edge Control. This is the consistency of the gel. So yeah, when it comes to edges, man, I'm going to die. Period, babe. Okay, friends, that is it for this installation. <laughs> I see the girls. The girls are out here in their leave out era, but sometimes you don't want to do the whole sew in for real things. So I feel like this is a really good in between solution. So I will have all the details for you to shop this hair in the description box, as well as other units from Ali Pearl Hair. They actually have really good hair. Outside of the kinky straight units that I tried, which very soft by the way, um, the other straight curly, kinky curly, all those other textures, 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10 would highly recommend that you check them out. And I feel like Ali Pearl's like an OG from AliExpress. So yeah, I do encourage you to do more research, watch more videos, see more reviews and hear what people are saying. And also if you've tried hair from Ali Pearl, please do leave a comment down below for anyone who is interested in purchasing. But from me, 10 out of 10 highly recommend. And it does take dye well as well, because you guys know I like dyeing my hair gently. But anyways, I'm taking long with this outro, so I'm gonna head out now. And it's too good. <laughs> so I will see you all in my next video. Thank you so much for watching, especially because I know that hair videos are not the most popular, but thank you guys for watching. Either way, I appreciate it a lot, I swear. I love you all so, 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 so much. <laughs>